Uh, good morning, everybody. My name is Anton, and I'm the co-founder of Murray VR, and we make Breakroom. It's an awesome new product that's bringing the uh, modern workspace into virtual reality. We have been dreaming about making this product for years, but the technology to make it happen is finally here. Now, I just want to help you understand virtual reality and Breakroom. So to do that, let's look at a scenario. You all know this one. You go on a plane and you need to get some work done. But you get stuck behind, uh, between two big guys and there's a pa crying baby behind you. It, it's quite horrible, but uh, what can you do? Well, you can put on your noise cancelling headphones, put on your uh, virtual reality headset and just enter another world. Isn't this nice? So much nicer than the oven, you yeah. know. This is break room. You instantly feel more comfortable without all the harassment. You can open up a display or a, a number of displays and focus on your work, and you can really get things done. So increased comfort, focus, and productivity. That's what a break room really is about. Now, this slide seems a bit information heavy, but that's what makes it so fun. It shows all the amazing things that are happening in virtual reality today. On the uh, far left, we have devices like enhanced reality, like the famous Google Glass up in the left-hand corner. Here, on the other side of the spectrum, on the right side, we have fully immersive virtual reality. For example, like the Oculus Lift. Uh, that's the gadget we are working on, and we're going to let you try out in the afternoon. Um, on this axis here, you can see all the things that are happening in the next year. We have companies like Sony, Samsung, Microsoft, Apple, Google, all fighting for their piece of the pie. But what we are waiting for is this one. That's when the consumer version of Oculus Rift comes out, and that's when we are going to be ready with Breakroom. Now, with all of these major players working in the hardware business, there must be some action on the software side of things. This graph shows the expected growth of uh, virtual reality software sales in the next few years. A UK-based consultancy that specializes in virtual reality market research made these predictions. This isn't just me making some actual acrobatics. And they expect $5 billion in sales in 2018 and rising superlinearly in the next few years. The market is split into three parts. The biggest one is uh, in entertainment. That's uh, video games, uh, video watching, etc. Another part we like to call uh, mirror worlds. That's when you can be in your living room and take a, a tour around the, the lure or, or, or see the Great Wall of China. Just visit another place and have a look around. Uh, the third segment, the last piece of the puzzle, are the practical uses of virtual reality, and they are endless. That's where we are. Workspace environments, medical usages, uh, training simulations, you name it. And not too many people are looking at that part, but we are. Now, we are making breakroom in a software called the Unity Engine. It's very popular with the virtual reality developers because of its simplicity, uh, simplicity of use. But uh, it also comes with, a, with an asset store. Developers can sell their solutions to other developers and so forth. And we're going to do, do that, sell our unique solutions for the next year to, to make some money before the actual uh, uh, Oculus Rift comes out. But when it does, in, in a year or so, it's going to come with an app store. We have that on very, very reliable sources. And that's where we're going to sell Breakroom. Just imagine if you knew that the Apple App Store was going to be a thing a full year before the release of the first iPhone. You would definitely jump on that uh, opportunity. And this one is similar. Our long-term mission is to make specialized solutions for companies that want to make their uh, employees feel more comfortable at work and be more productive. 
okay, we are Murray and we make break room. Things are really going great. We built a big network of uh, virtual reality enthusiasts through Startup Break Week and through our own efforts. Our CEO, Tidrik, is going uh, on the first international virtual reality conference in LA next month. He was specially invited because they like our progress. Uh, our ACE programmer has made some good headway, and we have another software developer joining us next month, and things are really happening. Now, in the end, I want to say there's just one problem with this presentation. It's warped onto a wall in some only two dimensional. It's lacking a dimension. So, uh, I invite you to, in the afternoon, come and see our booth, meet our team, and I dare you to try our product. It's really something else to step into another world. Thank you.